It's the first of its kind in Michigan, and it's a way for golfers to stay active when they're navigating from hole to hole. 7 and 4's Lissa Heron joins us live from Chippewa County to show us the new way golfers are pedaling their way around the golf course. Good morning, Melissa. Good morning, Brendan and Melissa. Joining me now is Dr. Richard Morrison, and we're here at the Minuscon Golf Course in Pickford, and we're driving um, a unique new way to get around the golf course. This is the golf bike. So, Richard, I'm going to have you describe to me um, how you guys decided to get these here at this golf course. You actually donated them, but why did you get this well, idea? Well, I used to play a lot of golf, and I didn't haven't played for many years. I wanted to get back doing it. In the middle of the winter, I woke up in the middle of the night saying, God, I'd love to start playing again. I don't want to bite on the golf car. I've done that in the soul. I, I wish I could use my bike. I'm an avid biker, a mountain biker, so... I got up and Google go golf bike, and here's what I found. It was amazing. It's Very just what cool. I was looking for. And so describe some of the features if somebody were to go out on one of these. Well, it's a six-speed bike. It's got 20-inch uh, wheels, which makes them accelerate faster. Uh, three uh, three and a half inch wide, smooth tires, good on the course. Place for 14 clubs on the side here, a little uh, insulated compartment here for your beverage and snacks. You have a wider kickstand base, so it doesn't dig into the grass and right. uh, six speeds uh, hand brakes works great okay so it doesn't slow down anybody's golf game well that's the big thing uh, you know a lot of courses discourage walkers so right. how do you get fit if you can't walk in a golf course absolutely you ride a bike you know and you were telling me earlier that you think this will help a lot of golf courses in northern michigan and you kind of hope that this trend picks up fewer people are playing golf a lot of the old golfers are getting too old to golf we need young people to make the game uh, thrive again. Right, and so um, kind of just describe how many bikes you have here and are they for rent right now? We have six bikes and uh, they will be for rent. Right now we're just letting people use them for free. We want people to get the experience of using a golf bike, see how they like it, maybe tell their friends about it. And we, uh, we posted pictures on Facebook and it's just gone viral. People are talking about it and sharing it and it's, it's got a lot, of, uh, a lot of talk. Oh yeah, and you said to make sure that you're using proper uh, oh, golf, golf course etiquette. etiquette. Yes, <laughs> you have to follow the uh, same golf cart etiquette where you go on the go, go, the paths and go 90 degrees to your ball in the fairways. So you're not driving on the fairways anymore than you have to. Of course, you don't drive on the greens. Oh, exactly. And you know, you were even saying that you hope this brings out a younger crowd to the golf. Definitely, yes. We we uh, every golf course I think is struggling today with uh, uh, reduced. Uh, you know, use of the courses, and we need to get younger people playing golf. This is the way they can uh, do it without having to rent a golf car. Absolutely, and right now they're very special to Michigan because these are as far the first as I know, kind, as you know, and as, as the company said as well, correct? Yes, this is the only golf fleet in the state of Michigan here in Pickford, Manasca, and Golf Course. <laughs> Wonderful. Well, you guys will have to come and check it out. Um, thank you so much for joining us this morning and let us ride these. They are a lot of fun, and I surely hope that this trend picks up. All of this information and more will be on our website at upnorthlive.com. Reporting live in Chippewa, Alyssa Heron, 7 and 4 News. Thanks a lot, Alyssa. What a beautiful day to I hit the golf know. course if you get some time off. Do you think you'd want to try something like that out? I've actually never been golfing. Putt-putt golfing. We're but that'd be a lot golfing. of fun. And we're going to probably try those. Only if one of those bikes are there. Okay. Okay, deal. Plus, I'm here live in Chippewa County. Coming up, we'll share a unique new way you can work in fitness with a fun game of golf. You're watching 7 and 4 News today. Good morning, Melissa. Good morning, Brendan and Melissa. Joining me now is Dr. Uh, Morrison, and he's a local uh, doctor here in town, and he's also the donor of these very unique golf bikes. And I'm going to try not to fall while I'm getting off. I did a little <laughs> bit earlier. Um, but first of all, I just want you to tell me, how did you get the idea to bring these to the Manuscon Golf Course? Well, uh, I, I used to play a lot of golf when I was younger. But for some reason, I got away from it. And uh, middle of the winter, I was lying in bed awake, and I said, I want to start playing some golf. I just picture being out here in the summertime. I want to play golf again. But I used to have a golf car, and I've, I sold that. I didn't want to get back into that stuff again. I said, you know, why, why can't I ride my bike on a golf course? I said, that's it. I said, yeah, I can ride my bike. I'm an avid biker, mountain biker. So um, I couldn't get back to sleep, got online, and... Uh, Google golf bike, and I'll pop this interview with Bubba Watson, who had won the Masters the year before, at a big Orlando golf show. 
and they're talking about his products, and they said, Bubba, you've been around the grounds the last couple of days. Anything uh, strike you as interesting? He said, golf bikes. And there was I your said, I said, there it is, <laughs> golf bikes, we have them. So I want you to kind of, you have six bikes that you donated out here, and I want you to kind of describe the features if somebody were to take one out. Well, they have 20-inch uh, wheels, which makes them accelerate faster. They have three and a half inch wide tires here, so they're good on the greens, uh, good on, well, don't go on the greens, but good on the golf <laughs> course. Place for 14 the clubs here along the side of the back tire. You have your cooler here to put your beverage and your snack and so forth. And plenty of little pockets on the side here for your golf balls and your tees and so forth. Everything you need. Okay, and there's several different gears we have six, here as We have well. six gears that are geared pretty low so you can go up hills and uh, go on, you know, in the rough and so forth. And, and not only is this good, you know, for a fun game of golf, but it's also good for health and fitness. And you were saying even bringing younger crowds into golf courses well, that's, in that's Northern point, Michigan. Because every golf club in Northern Michigan, I think, is suffering right now. And we're suffering up now because ever since 9-11, the Canadians aren't coming over. It's still much of a hassle to get across the bridge. We lost all our uh, many Canadian customers, so we need to get younger people involved in the game of golf. Okay, so do you think that you're going to see this bike, you know, going around to more places? Well, I think so. I think so. I think it's going to catch on. Oh, yeah. And I see a lot of bikers up here in northern Michigan, so I hope it does, too. Yeah, we're the first in the state of Michigan <laughs> that I know of. All right. Well, very cool. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Well, and coming you, up at 630, we'll show you what more it has to offer. All of this information and more will be on our website at uppnorthlive.com. Brendan, Melissa, you think you're going to try it out? That looks like I want to do it. <laughs>